Hi everyone, I'm Geohot, and I have a demo for you today, a demo of EDA, the Embedded Disassembler. And this is the new EDA, EDA 2.0, which has a completely new code base, uh, which has been written in the last two weeks. Uh, POSIX Ninja has guided me through some design problems, and Pumpkin has guided me through some CS problems. So I think this is pretty good, and I have a real demo for you with like moving stuff, not just with one picture on the blog this time. Enjoy! First off, you can see how nicely EDA welcomes you. Uh, it has a very idle-like interface. You see I can drag this around. I can use the scroll wheel to move up and down. What you see on the right side here are a list of functions. These functions happen to be the functions in the 3G boot ROM. And they were imported from an IDC file, which makes migrating from IDA to EDA very easy. So see, watch, I can just double click on a function here. You can see it draws a nice graph of the flow of the function. Um, I can rename things. And I can follow branches. And I even implemented the uh, gliding like Ida, which I thought was a very important feature to implement. So you can see the line drawing algorithm isn't so good right now. But I hacked it together this morning. Shouldn't be easy to clean, shouldn't be uh, hard to clean that up. So this is a very small feature set of what EDA is eventually going to be capable of. Imagine clicking up here, saying run function. It runs through the function and then shows you exactly how the instruction pointer traveled. Not only does it show you that, but I can click on any instantiation of an instruction and view the entire state of the system, uh, registers and memory at that time. Not just any instruction, but every time that instruction is run it saves the state. So I can see an instruction, oh it's been here three times this is what the memory looked like before, this is what the memory looked like after. I really think this is going to revolutionize reverse engineering if implemented correctly because so much time is spent, oh well, what does this function really do, what does this little block do? Just hit run, type some stuff in, see what it did, oh now I see and then you can give it a reasonable name. Um, so yeah this EDA is all open source. Check out the entry on the iPhone wiki just under EDA. Or if you want the source code, go to GitHub. It's uh, geohot slash EDA dash reversing. If you're good with C++ or good with JavaScript, we need you.